Hi, my name's Car, and welcome to my tea time. Today, we will talk about some wacky and strange state laws from the state of Idaho. I've never been to Idaho, but that's what we're gonna talk about today. So, stay tuned. Tea time with Tea Time with Car. Hope you all have something wonderful to drink. I am just drinking distilled water and some ice because it's extremely hot in the southeastern United States. I'm trying to stay hydrated and cool. But speaking of cool, let's get into these Idaho laws where I'm sure it's much cooler there than it is in Alabama. <laughs> in Idaho, it is forbidden to go fishing off of a camel. First off, like I have a lot of questions about this. Like I didn't even know camels like live in the United States. I mean, of course we have camels in zoos, but I don't think camels are native to the United States. If they are, let me know, please. I mean, I don't know much about animals or things like that, especially like where their native habitats are. But I mean, I guess a camel is a very sturdy animal. It will be very quiet, I'm assuming. You could sit very high up so you could look, you would have like a nice view of it. But I, I don't know where that came from. I mean, maybe someone was driving through Idaho back in the day and was like, hey, I got these camels for sale. Let's go fishing off of it. Maybe someone got injured. Who knows? But apparently that is the law on the books in Idaho that you cannot go fishing off of a camel. So just do it the normal way off some sort of boat or ship. And yeah, that's that crazy law for Idaho. So the second one is, is that in some areas of Idaho, it is illegal to buy onions after the sun has set after dark. I don't know, just in some areas that law is like on the books, I don't get it, but that's that. So the third one is that you can't hunt from a helicopter. And that's whether the helicopter is in flight or whether it's like, stationary so there is no hunting from helicopters at all and interesting fact i actually am not a fan of helicopters because like in most movies that i see dealing with the helicopter the helicopter always like ends up malfunctioning or not making its like trip so i'm not a huge fan of helicopters because they always end up like just not making it or being destroyed for lack of a better term. So you're not gonna catch me hunting from a helicopter at all in, in, in any instance. It doesn't even have to be Idaho, but just in general, like you should not be hunting from a helicopter. And I mean, if you did, you would definitely have to have like a whole bunch of money and some crazy permits to be able to do that. So at least that's what I think in my head. So in Idaho Falls, they're a bit ageist, so it is illegal to ride motorcycles if you're over the age of 88. So for those of you that are half of 88, might as well go ahead and just get to riding motorcycles as much as you can because as soon as you hit the double ocho digits, you will not be able to ride motorcycles in Idaho Falls. I don't know, I'm not gonna touch it, but I don't understand it, but that's in Idaho Falls. So this one's kind of wonky. It's illegal to ride a merry-go-round on Sunday. I mean, Sunday for like most people is kind of like family day. And so what do you do with your family? You go to a wonderful park, you ride the merry-go-round, you go do all these other things. But I guess in Idaho, all the merry-go-rounds are like empty because there are no kids playing on them because it is illegal to do so. According to like these wacky laws of Idaho. <laughs> So like I used to have like this amazing supervisor when I was in college. She was like the resident director and she actually moved to Pocatello, Idaho and I've always wanted to go to Pocatello. And I think that's where like Napoleon Dynamite was filmed which is one of my favorite movies and I love like the theme song of it. That Jacorme song, it is amazing. Canned heat, yeah, just had to think of it. But in Pocatello, 
The interesting thing is that like it's illegal to like frown. Like there's this weird law where it's like you can't have like a frowned upon disposition or something like that. Like I'll find it and I'll put it in the comments, but like you literally, they want you to smile, which I think is very interesting to actually make a law out of that, that some people got together to actually draft that and to actually make it a law where it is illegal to frown in Pocatello, Idaho. This last law I actually agree with. So in Eagle, Idaho, it is illegal for you to sweep like dirt, I guess, and trash or debris or whatever you wanna call it from your home onto the street. I agree with that completely. Get you a dustpan or even if you don't have a dustpan, do it like the old school method of like, getting a sturdy piece of paper towel, I, paper, like, I don't know, you gotta have like strong hands or like, I don't know, some sort of like willpower to get that paper bent the right way where you can like hold the paper and then like sweep it up onto the paper and use the paper as a makeshift dustpan. If that's what you gotta do, that's what you gotta do because apparently you can't be sweeping your trash from your house onto the street in Eagle, Idaho. I don't know, I guess a lot of people were doing that and they were like, you guys gotta stop. Who knows? But that is all the time that we have today for these crazy and wacky Idaho state laws. And comment below your favorite law or like some weird law that you just found out about. I would love to hear it and love to share it. But hit the like button, subscribe, notification bell, all those other good things. And just know that if you ever need a chat over tea, you certainly know where to find me. Bye. Tea time. Wes. Come.